Hello Bacon. I was attacked by Hyperfox again. And I just need to have this Jeremy Scott teddy bear hoodie that I saw in a movie for 30 seconds. <sighs> We are patterning today the uh, Jeremy Scott teddy bear hoodie that he made for Adidas. It appeared for 30 seconds in everything, everywhere, all at once. And of course I fell in love with it and I need one teddy bear sleeved hoodie. I have here already my pattern straight. We're gonna start with the front and back as usual. Everything to the high figure point as usual. And I'm going to manipulate this pattern as I did for the Absalom costume. It's Meat fabric. These two will be closed. This will be moved to this part. This will be removed from the bottom. But also a bit creepy. Of course it is a bit creepy. Close these two first. So and now we have a huge dart. This is such a dramatic line. I don't know if I like it. And I think I'm gonna go like this. Here I will remove one inch from the front and the shoulder. And that's the front. This is the mistake I made the, the others because look how, how much difference I have from the back to the front. I need to make this longer. Let's get to the important piece. La pièce de résistance. We have the sleeve. There is a cuff. The cuff fabric I bought will allow me to add four wait, inches. Wait, wait a second. Yeah, I, I lost the fabric. This is the fabric for the hoodie. It's just a normal knit. And I lost the fabric for the cuff. I will remove only two inches then. Just to be on the safer side. Like the sleeve cap is normal and then his, his face like starts right here. So I think this one I'm gonna do like this and prepare the bear. Here are will be the ears. This will be complicated. Draping arms. I think I'm gonna have to drape this. My brain is, is frozen in place. There is an inner sleeve because otherwise all the fluff from the bear will get out. So I will make a base sleeve and I will build the bear. I will build a bear <laughs> on top of that. Yes. Jesus Lord. I have no idea what I'm doing. Today I, f I woke up, chose violence and I'm working in a new sleeve cap. But I inserted darts so I can spread it and give it a better shape. Fix this curve and this is the new sleeve cap. One hero. Wow. I'm rich bitch. This is just round here in the middle like so. See what I'm doing? Does it make sense? I don't think it does. <laughs> transfer paper. Transfer paper. The wheel of doom. Doom. Oh, I hate transfer paper so much. So much. I think it's my mimeographer trauma. This is supposed to be round. 21 and a half. No. It will go like this and then it will go like this and then the rest of the face. I don't need math. Just need geometry. Here to here. I'm going off the rails right now because I don't know what I'm doing. Let's pretend this is this is right. Yay, no rails. Ah, <laughs> I'm so confused. And also the proportions are totally yeah, wacky. There's a seam on the on the forehead. You can see this one that the pattern is kind of wonky. And the head doesn't go all the way back. It's just like a really a circle here in the front. And the body starts here then. I'm going to make in the matching shoes. Oh, you saw the shoes. I want to make. Ah. Crazy of life. Maybe you used to look for a teddy bear pattern. Hey! We don't go the easy way here. We like to suffer and that's cheating. <laughs> if it doesn't work, if I get annoyed, I will definitely search for a teddy bear pattern. I am already stressed enough. Stressed enough. Remove the bottom part again. Now I remember why I haven't draped in such a long time. I find flat patterns so much easier to work with. However, this one would not go well. This is the new face. Now we have a face that's supposed to be a face and the body will come from this side. This is all because I'm a strong independent woman that does not want help making this work. Do you understand? <laughs> I'm so concentrated here trying to make this curve work. This is the body. Do you see it? Do you see it? Because <laughs> I don't see it yet. You can see the bear. We I understand this now. Do you have enough space at the top of the sleeve? Seems to be pulling forward. This thing is not going where it's supposed to go. Oh. No, no, no. I, no, I see no. what's happening now. This thing cannot go all the way down. It needs to stop here somehow, like up on the upper part of the face, so not to pull everything down. The surgery is almost done. <laughs> the extension of the sleeve cap will come just up to here, so it is free to move. The ears will come here in the snoot, and then the arms and the body, and that's it. This is the sleeve cap extension to give the bear a little bit more space for its head. This is the head, top and bottom with, with the dart. This is the body that will make everything work. <laughs> I think this is it. I, I'm dead. But hey, it will work. It will and work. And if it isn't, then it will just be another cursed thing that I make. Comes with the package. That's it. 
was searching for. These are empty felt tip pens. Put any kind of paint inside. And I was searching for mm -hmm. such a long time. For this project, I need more control on my hands than I generally have with the brush. So this is where the paint will go. And then I have to put it all together. Can I remove this? Yes, I did it with my teeth. Now I have a bigger opening. I need a fully. <gasps> Come on. I guess I should have cleaned up my desk before I started this because there's a lot of fabric from another project that cannot get dirty. <laughs> But hey, it's me. Hi, I'm the problem. It's me. I'm going to add a little bit of water. Ooh, that was too much. Ah! Stop it! Stupid. Mmm. All dirty. Love it. Shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it. Well, the balls are not moving. That's what she said. I don't get it. Oh, no, there's only water is getting out. Okay, this is not working. I think the paint is way too. Of course I thought this would work from the first. Now there's a lot of water inside. Okay, it didn't work. Let's try something else. Working. It's an acrylic pen. I bought it on Amazon and it just it works better. But it's also smelling like alcohol. What will happen if I put alcohol in the paint instead of water? Let's try with alcohol. So Ooh. That was okay. Alcohol. You see the paint stays where I put the line and the alcohol spreads further. So this might be an adjustment that I will need to make when painting. But paint is flowing so much better now. A little bit too watery. It works. <laughs> Aha, <laughs> newsflash. It works like an alcohol marker. Like the more paint you put, then better layers you have. Because this is how alcohol alcohol markers work. The water one. See how it doesn't, doesn't move? And this is the water dye. Oh, it works better. But look at that bleeding. <laughs> oh, this is cool for a tie-dye effect. <laughs> friend got stuck in the woods so I was helping them find something and look how this spread in the five ten minutes I was outside crazy so this is definitely not a solution for my problem alcohol takes over okay I'm learning things <laughs> nice <laughs> I decided on screen printing because my pen idea will not work and it will be a lot so whatever. So let's get this on the silhouette, shall we? The machine didn't just eject the mat, it yeeted it into oblivion on the other side. Uh, Seriously. Where is it? Where is it? Is that it? Is that it? That means I'm gonna have to start from scratch and I hate it, but I will do it later. I'm gonna have to put this on a more stable, what's the name? More stable surface. I hate it. Kiwi. You so much. Oh. oh, nice. I'm just having conversations with myself while trying to make this work. So this is amazing. You can see how crazy I am. Okay, hope this goes now. Front and back, enough space now. Are you happy with the, the, the result of your cut job? I don't know yet. I don't know yet. I hate this finicky bull. Seriously. Oh, I regret the day I bought this thing because it did not cut through. I tried one of the legs of the flower. Oh, you. I hate this. You a hit it, I hit it, I hit it. Day is rage. Ugh. I think now everything is cut accordingly. No movement, it's looking good. All of the flowers and the circles are here. I had an idea. This is transfer masking tape that I got years ago. <laughs> Cooperation, please. Don't be weird. No, no. It's a free. And it didn't cut through. Still did not cut through. This can't be. I think I'm the only one who is not able to do anything with this. Aside from getting wrinkles and being angry. Wanna tell me to later? <laughs> paint is reacting so weird. It, it's acrylic paint and screen printing paint and it just like turned into this bubble of ew. Anyone want a scoop of paint? I mean, it kind of looks like cream cheese. Yeah, it looks like icing. And it smells good actually. Sweet smell, but I cannot place it. If it doesn't catch fire, I'm okay, but oh, it's 
so bad with the wobbles. We'll start uh, with the small one, right? With the mid one, because I, do, I don't want to go so small. And I'm going to print the flower first, and then I will reprint the, the circle on top of it, like the center. What have, what have, what the hell have I done? I messed up already. The first flower. Can you? It's just a test. Of course, you put it on the center of the yeah. fabric, right? Not, not starting at the edge. Because no. What are you talking about? If you want to mess up, you have to do it properly. <gasps> it worked. It did work. I thought it didn't, but it did. Okay. Look. Of course it worked. We have a yeah. flower. It's so exciting. <laughs> There's paint coming out of the side. I have weird lines now. I will put it here, right in the middle. And now I have a lot of spots that should not be there. Maybe I'll just like screen print some balls out of nowhere just to hide those. <laughs> and the blue, where's the blue? I lost the blue bottle. No, I lost the blue bottle. Can you see it? No, I can't see it. Wait, I'm gonna take you with me. Do you see the bottle looks like this? Oh my God, what did I do with it? Oh, you are the first person to actually go through a gremlin attack with me my leprechauns honestly at this point i'm not gonna even search for it like maybe it will turn up maybe not i have more blue over there <gasps> i found it I found oh it. my god oh my it's god. under the table <laughs> and everything and is blue i love you bye turns out i was the gremlin all along i found it i found under it under my table <sighs> Are you freaking kidding me? This was a new bottle and half of it is on the floor that's so dirty that I cannot pick this color up So I'm just gonna leave this here to dry. I don't want to deal with this mess right now But the flowers are looking cute, aren't they? Look, look, look. I'm waiting for it to dry so I can add more flowers in the empty spaces Because if I put the screen on top of it then this will happen and I don't want it and for each of these mishaps I think I will just put a ball on it <laughs> A surque Now I'll go upstairs and eat I'm hungry again I need tiny purple flowers now oh, Tiny no. purple what? flowers Then I can start printing the center of the flowers zers, zers, zers. All of the flowers zers, zers, zers. Wait, why? This is old? Oh, this is old Hi, why don't you subscribe? Yes, come to the weird side Hello? of the internet Oh, I'm so nervous today. Very nervous. E close. I think it's fine from the distribution and the other things will have balls because I need to hide all my mistakes. Let this dry. I'm still considering if I will dye the base fabric and the colors of the dye should only influence the fabric and not the flowers. But I kind of like the white. And <laughs> I don't have such a sparkly radioactive green or yellow here. And I don't want to buy more of anything because I need to de-stash as soon as possible. I think I'm going to leave it white. <laughs> just finished adding the center and the bobbles to the fabric to hide my mistakes mm -hmm. <laughs> and also fixing some things along the way it's a pretty happy fabric i like it however this color is hideous and i think i will redo it but i'm not sure you would be a very good idea <gasps> The fabric almost fell on the paint that's still under the table. <gasps> I just tried my best pair of scissors with another project. There was a pin in the middle of the fabric that I didn't see. And now I have no good scissors to cut fabric. Don't be destroyed like your sister. Better. Sorry, I'm a bit a little let down. I hope I have enough printed fabric for hoodie and all the bare pieces. We decided to change the bag for pig, but not such a dramatic change. It's just a snoot and the shape of the ear. I will have enough for the hoodie. <laughs> it's not that I won't have fabric at all, but I don't want to print all of this again. It was very annoying. Not only I forgot the seam allowance on the cuff, I forgot the seam allowance on one of the sides. Just hope when something is sensitive in terms of material or 
time or whatever, then I'll mess it up. And I am still searching for the cuff. Don't mess up this one, because this one is not supposed to be messed up. You know what I forgot before cutting? Change the center of the yellow flower. Keep changing it in the pieces that I have. Sounds like a good plan. No, the moon. Open and close the mouth. This one has a very crooked jaw. This one is okay. I'm gonna leave the crooked jaw. It's an angry pig. Very angry. It's like <clears throat> angry. I need to paint. I cannot finish both pigs today. This was not in my schedule for today. I need to be careful with the glue. This is just the most perfect eye placement ever. I'm gonna have big blue eyes. <laughs> oh, I lost the ear. Oh, things are drying on the rack. Then I will repaint them. I was assembling one of the sleeve pigs and I lost one of the ears and I can't find it anywhere. I cleaned the room. It's gone. It disappeared. Anyway, totally related to what we're doing right now. I don't wear makeup. But I do love a good lips. This week I was influenced by Nikki tutorials and I had to buy Christian Dior lipstick. The liquid forever glitter and it just came. I bought from the website directly. Look at this packaging. Come on. I have to transform this into a bag like forever. It's so pretty. <laughs> and this here will be my wallet. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so totally doing that. This will be a bag. I'm scared of opening it. <gasps> Ooh. This will stay here, protected from the world and for myself. Purpose. And it has glitter. I mean, what? Of course I messed up the application, but it's like you put it on, you wait for it to dry, and then you like smack your lips and all of the glitter becomes like there. I love it. I love it. So much. Look at this. So much glitter. I'm dead. Oh wow. Okay, I'm wearing lipstick every day at home just for me. I feel beautiful in my lipstick and sweater. I'm a lipstick sweater basement goblin. We have part of a hoodie with ears already. And I still haven't found the ears. How could the ear? There's one ear that's missing. How could it have disappeared like that? I have balls in my hand. Oh, what? I don't want to make another ear before I have sorted the hands. Turns out I don't have enough fabric for the legs. So I have to reprint this much fabric. For the legs. For the cats. For the chichu. Susho. She here. Hi, this is the oh, machine for me. Hi! Didn't find the other ear. I made a new one. Now I just need to paint these so I can finally finish assembling tomorrow. <laughs> I needed the blue. This project is becoming very, very cursed. Oh, this is so much better. Yeah. I want to touch it. One thing I'm not enjoying is the fact that the flowers are not so crisp as the original. And I also won't have fabric for the shoes. Oh, it's yeah, so sad. Go there, go there, go there. One piggy face is done. Ah! Kind of wonky. It's a pig. It's a pig. Pig <laughs> One sleeve is mounted and poof, very blob. It's a pig with feetsies, very big head. Found the ribbon fabric, but it's off-white, doesn't really match. So I will dye it. And I don't know, I'm, I'm in a yellow thing now. <laughs> and then I'll go back to bed because I'm exhausted. Exhausted. <laughs> I was checking the original and it's not just a hoodie, it is kind of a jacket. It's lined and it has some chunk inside. I don't have a chunk that I can apply to this because it needs to be that fleece that you buy by the meter. I just have flocks, it will not look good. But I will insert a colorful lining to this to make it look prettier. And it will be this rainbow jersey. Matches, right? Let, let's work, let's work. Mm -hmm. And other middle of the middle Mark. all the things that happen with the thing. Oh my god. Back, 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 back. back. <laughs> the nose is not centered. How did I do that? How? <laughs> this is going to be weird. This one is already the one that's lopsided with a lopsided angry mouth. <laughs> what I did for him to have such a huge head. Like he has the biggest head ever. It's okay. A lot of bacon. Come on. Ooh. I'm sweating. I'm in this for 30 seconds and I'm sweating. Yes. I have to put more flowers. The gaps are way too big. Especially in the boob area. The back is okay. I, I need more flowers. I'm just so glad that they never pattern matched anything. So that's fine. Ooh. And I found the most perfectest of zippers. This was gifted to me by Gwen Shenanigans. Isn't it pretty? I love it.
it. Finally, something worthy of oh, it. I'm sweating. <laughs> the beauty with the ears. I'm, I'm in love with this. I will embrace this forever. I think I'm going to fly to Brazil with this. And the airplane? Seriously? I need an extra seat on each side just to fit the peaks. And this is like the most perfect pairing with my moon boots, right? Ugh. Let me get out of this. I had to take it off. It's quite warm, but I love it. It's really cozy. Oh. I could stay in it forever if it weren't so warm. Maybe it's a good thing for, for going out now in the winter. Mm. Yeah, How, what do you think? Thanks for watching, see you in the next one.